it's important to understand the function of the respiratory and circulatory systems so you will recognize the importance of oxygen. The human body requires a constant supply of oxygen for normal cellular function and metabolism. These processes use oxygen and produce carbon dioxide. In the absence of oxygen, the cells will die. Some cells, like those found in the brain and central nervous system, are most sensitive to a lack of oxygen and will die within a matter of minutes. The two primary systems responsible for the delivery of oxygen to the body are the respiratory and circulatory systems. The respiratory system is responsible for the exchange of oxygen and carbon dioxide between the body and the environment. This exchange takes place at the alveoli, the smallest structures of the lung. Oxygen inhaled from the atmosphere into the lungs is traded there for carbon dioxide from the body. The carbon dioxide, metabolism's waste product, is expelled during the exhalation phase of respiration. The circulatory system carries gases from the lungs and transports them throughout the body. Oxygen is ultimately delivered to bodily tissues by the capillaries, the body's smallest vessels. It is here, too, that CO2 is picked up. The circulatory system then repeats the cycle, and the process is reversed in the lungs. It's the combination of the respiratory and circulatory systems that are responsible for providing oxygen to the tissues of the body. If an injury occurs to either system, oxygen supply may decrease, resulting in hypoxia, an inadequate supply of oxygenated blood.